Hey guys, just stopping and today this is buy of the day. No, I'm just kidding. I just reviewed so much shit as the buy of the day. <clears throat> oh my god, my voice. But I found this set of roses. I just I was like I felt bad about this, I had buyer's remorse, but I still just want to review it. It has DC or two double A's. So I got some Duracells. What the fuck? What is that correct? At them is 76 to 108. Is that even possible? See, well, the tunings were correct. The kilohertz are correct. I, I think. Uh, ear, earphone jack, carrying strap, AM, FM, 2 band radio, LED tune indicator. There's the battery. This reminds me of the Sony ICF C Chem. No, K. 10 KMS2 or something. I don't remember. This is the supersonic super 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 It has to be taken with you on hiking super Piece of shit radio. Well, let's see if it is a piece of shit. It was seven dollars at roses yeah. I'll return this because if, if it's not a DSP radio, I'm gonna return it because That's if I know what a DSP radio is Okay, give me, give me, get out, boy. Oh, this has a hand strap. This is light. Probably will gain some weight with some batteries, so. Hey, let me check the volume. Oh, it is off. The one time I actually checked, it is off. Man, this, this cover's cheap. We made, that's for sure. It's got an aerial. Oh, that's a long aerial. I'm not sure dimensions, but it's pretty small. I mean, it's about four inches tall, I'd say. Four and a half. Really long antenna. Probably about four, three times its size, that's for sure. Uh, earphone jack. Well, it's on AM. The tuning's kind of... Smooth and bad at the same time. Let's try it. Ah, full of shit. Man, this has a good sound, actually. This is your pilot speaking flight. That's my radio station. Nice tuning indicator. about you, baby. Wow, I'm actually impressed by this thing. I'm an AM, I'm an FM listener, not an AM, so that's why I don't care. We're gonna see if this rate, if this is a good AM. But so right now, how good I'm starting to not gum. I just put some in me. That's my mouth, to be precise. I don't want that to sound wrong. Um. I just showed you a little bit, but that's good for FM. For, I'm an FM listener. Let me see. Yes, it's a DSP radio. This is, uh... This is on, uh, AM. and it's covering more than 38,000 acres. So thoughts and prayers going out to our friends and families in Monterey. Uh, take care of yourself above all. Hey, we can get back vineyards. We can get back everything else.
Can hear something. Wow, that can go loud. I apologize for that. Okay. That was actually a good radio. For $7. I'm actually impressed with this thing. This is impressive. For I mean, for the price. AM was okay reception, but at least it's DSP, step tuning. But, FM was pretty good sound. So, we're going to compare this to the Jensen MR75. Which is a... Certainly better than that Sentry. I mean, this, this is like twice as good as the Sentry. I'd pay $14 over the Sentry to get this guy. I mean... There's a scratch because of my OCD problems, obsessive. But, well, you have a new arm. Today's luck. There's actually a good radio. I found a free mower that was in perfect working condition. I mean, but those antennas are like the Super Sonic's twice as long as this Jensen. Well, we're trying to do AM, but just for the video, I'm going to have another radio with me that does have the same station. Hey, where's the, oh, my GPX is right there. This is going to be here just for the video. This is another shitty radio tool, though. Don't, don't get this one. But it has my AM station on it. FM. We're gonna see the let's compare the AM reception. I hear something. Oh I'm a complete idiot. So this starts at 17 and goes to 530. Well this one goes there. So that's why we're finding we found almost no stations and so far on that in this little halfway. Keep in mind, it's the 28th, it's 814, and there's a bunch of clouds, cl clouds in. Get assigned a creature? I think that Supersonic did better than the Jensen. If I hate to say it, but this was ten dollars, and this was seven. This is actually a good radio. I really recommend you pick one up. Now, to uh, avoid the Century PR seven ninety nine and avoid the Inden BCR one one nine. These are both shit ski radios. I just kept. Well, Wow, this is this impressed me. I I thought it was gonna be a piece of shit. It was actually decent for the money. I mean, so thanks for watching. This top from.